Hey there and welcome to Travel TV on independent.ie. I'm Paula Canilla and today we're travelling to Westport. It's been voted Ireland's top place to live, our national tourism town, but did you know this Mayo Mecca is also turning into an adventure hub? Take a look. Westport is synonymous with staycations. A bustling town, epic coastal setting and the Great Western Greenway are just some of the reasons visitors come in their droves. But lately, it's been adding some new strings to its bow. Claire Cullen reports. So we're here at Westport House to try our hand at absorbing and a bit of zip lining. Do the two of you be in it together? Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So what we'll do is... Um, in one? No, not Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do the two, because the two seats are together. <laughs> and you, you, face, you face each other. Oh my God, that'd be so much yeah. fun. Absorbing was really good fun, but it's not for the weak of stomach. Did you feel like puking? A little bit, yeah. So Westport's well known for being a bit of a party town, so if you're going to be mixing partying and adventuring, I maybe wouldn't do the absorbing first thing in the morning. No, it's like an afternoon <laughs> for sure. Yes, I remember getting yeah. into it and just laughing my ass off just over and over and over and over again. So by the end of it, I was ready for lie down nearly, not due to the physical activity, just because I'd laughed so much. Yeah, it's a real involuntary reaction. You just sort of laugh the whole way down, yeah. All right, what else did you do? So I tried zip lining, um, and in Westport House, they measured, they told me anyway that they measured it and they got it up to 45 kilometers an hour, and they claim it's the fastest zip line in Ireland. The fa but, so what are you going over? It's a big field it's full big of sheep, field. or? <laughs> no, I didn't spot any sheep now, but it's a big green field, and you just fly down it. Yeah. They have a really advanced braking system that breaks you at the last minute, which is, it's, it's a little bit scary. <laughs> Could anyone do it? Like kids, older people, is it anyone can do this? Or? Yeah, I believe there's a height restriction but other than that I think anyone can do it as long as you're ready for a bit of excitement. By now the Great Western Greenway is known all over the world. A 42 kilometer cycling trail built along the route of the old Westport to Ackle Railway, it's brought a whole new lease of life to West Mayo and pretty much anyone can do it. The other thing I wanted to ask about is Great Western Greenway. I haven't done it yet, but I'm very excited. To, I really have wanted to do it for ages. It's next on my list. What have you heard about it? Why do you want to do it? So I love cycling, and basically anyone who likes cycling has recommended that to me. I kind of like to go around Ireland and do all these different things, and the amount of people that have recommended the Greenway cycle, it's it's yeah. definitely high, high on my list. I'm not, I don't know if you cycle now. I'm not a, a huge cyclist, reasonably fit, but it's 42 kilometers beginning to end, so I ended up with the sorest butt in Mayo yeah. and it was yeah. only 42 kilometers. You should get the shorts with the paddle. Get the shorts <laughs> but here's another tip if you only want to do 16 kilometers or just go Westport to Mulrani or to Newport or whatever the bike guys will come and pick you up oh, and put the bike not, back in the boot and take you home. You don't have to do it all. And there you have it just three of the adventures taking Westport to the next level and believe me there's lots more where they came from. Now thanks to Claire for joining me in studio today. She travelled as a guest of DestinationWestport.com and thanks too to Westport House, Adventure West and DiscoverIreland.ie for their help with footage. And the prices? Well you can have one go in Zorb and two goes on the zipline at Westport House for all of 20 euro. Till next time, safe travels.